Hi guys. Okay, so this embryonic development, these designer babies, is an interesting topic. I mean, obviously it's exciting uh, scientific advances and stuff. Um, but there are definite advantages and disadvantages to the subject. Um, some advantages are obviously the perfect child, the beautiful, perfect baby, no sicknesses, no illnesses, none of that sort of thing. Some disadvantages would be the amount of risk that's involved. It's obvious, it's not a uh, certain for sure thing at this point, so it's going to definitely have some risks and, and things involved like uh, not getting the right genes cut out or the embryo not being able to grow and develop. So, definite problems there. I personally feel like this is not a good thing. Because to me, every, everybody's perfect in their own sort of way. I mean, I mean, how do you even define perfect? There's no definition. It's just a societal standard of perfect that we're going for. Um, and that takes, that kind of takes that out of that and it takes our uniqueness away and and stuff so I don't feel like it's good for that reason another reason is is a sort of natural selection is taken out of the whole process I mean if we had no diseases and no sicknesses in the world we would be deal dealing with all sorts of people that aren't dying, which I know is probably a good thing, but at the same time it's not, because then we're overpopulated, and we're already struggling to deal with the population we have now. I mean, what are we going to do when we have even more that are going to live longer, be healthier, you know? And then not only that, but what do all the healthcare workers do? Those people that take care of those sick people? That they make their livelihood out of that. They live off of the money they make doing that. And so there would be nothing for them to do. We'd have to come up with other jobs to do. And we can't even come up with enough jobs to support the population now. So this creates more problems, I feel like, in what I how I see it. Um, also, I feel like having a child is a special journey that you endure when you find a spouse and you decide to have a family. But there's a an excitement I would feel in knowing that you've created something and not knowing what that is until it's here and you go through the journey and you find out who that person is and what they can do and you know and how beautiful they are themselves not how you want them to be. I mean, if you're really a loving parent, you're going to love your child no matter what, whether they have brown hair and blue eyes or uh, blonde hair and brown eyes, whatever. If they're strong or weak or tall or short, that that's all up to the pers the genetics. And if we make that something we control, we lose sight of that uniqueness and that special excitement and journey that you endure when you go to make a family, so I don't feel like it's ethically moral or, or a good idea by any sort of standard. That's just my opinion.